out with pink reddies again another big group dig um, same area as was before in Essex loads of land about 11 fields probably like 300 acres or something stupid like that loads of it got stubble we've got cultivated land loads of Roman history Saxon Celtic people have had staters around here and all sorts of stuff so yeah hopefully I'm gonna find something good today um, please subscribe if you haven't already please like as well and I'll see you on the first decent target all right see you in a bit all right, first target of the day, here's a little button. Surprise, surprise. All right, guys, next one's in here somewhere. Let's find it. It's there. Okay. Um, yeah, it's just a little bit of lead. <clears throat> All right, guys, got a good signal here. It's slightly scratchy, but it's quite a good one. Let's have a look what it is. Let's see if it's up. Right, it's still in there. I don't think it's very deep though. Get the old pinpoint out. There somewhere. Ah, oh, it's another bit of lead. Yep, yeah, it's a little bit of lead. All right, on to the next. All right, guys, next one's in this clod here somewhere. Got a nice clean sort of tone. Could be a coin. Could be another bit of lead. Getting lots of lead today. No, oh, no, what is it? It's that. It's like a big bloody. Oh, is that a button? Some sort of button? Yeah, that's weird. I don't know what that is. It's got. I reckon it's like some sort of button or something. Might have had something on it at some point. Yeah, I don't know. I've not had a button like that before. Cool. Right, I'll see you on the next one. Right, here's the next one, guys. Little musket ball. Not a bad one. Right, see you on the next one, guys. Um, yeah, I just had this tiny little scratchy signal. Um, yeah, and I, I got this out. No, I don't know. That looks like it could be a fragment of a hammer to me. What do you think? It just looks... It's got that silvery sort of look to it. Another little piece broke off there and I pulled it up. Yeah, it's just it's a really scratchy signal, but I thought I'd dig it anyway. But um yeah, I don't know. Just got a silver look to it. Got a little round edge there. And it could be part of a hammered. Very tiny part. But yeah. It's the closest I've got to a hammer so far anyway. Alright, I'll see you on the next. Just had this one out guys. It's like a little lead token. I might have some detail on there. It's a bit... Just trying to straighten it out a bit. Yeah, I reckon that's got something on it. Um, a second. Just give it a little squirt. Yeah, it's definitely got something on it. Don't know what, but yeah, I think that's a little lead token. Nothing on that side. Don't know what sort of age that would be, maybe 
medieval or something, I'm not sure. That's pretty cool though. All right, see you on the next. All right guys, just got what could be the first coin of the day. I oh, actually know, getting closer to it, looks like it could be a button. No, oh, it's a shotgun, <laughs> shotgun cartridge. Oh well. All right, on to the next. All right guys, do a little live dig. Got a decent signal there, it's a little bit, a bit scratchy, but sounds half decent, so see what it is. I think it might be in the side wall. Maybe not. I'll just dig it up here. No, it's like I've lost it. Alright guys, I was way out with my pinpointing. It was like right at the back of the hole. Um, yeah, anyway. So it's in here somewhere, I think. Oh, it was. That's it. Ah, there it is. <laughs> Bloody shotgun cartridge. Oh well. Alright, moving on. Alright, just had this one here, guys. It's like a big old piece of bronze. God knows what it is. I don't know. Any ideas, stick it in the comments. I ain't got a clue. It's a banging signal. But, yeah, I don't know. Yeah. Alright, see you in the next. Right guys, I've had enough of the stubble fields. I've had some lunch, re-energized. We're gonna hit the cultivated fields. They've been done quite a bit before by other people, but you never know. It's been Roman and Celt um, Celtic, Celtic, what am I talking about? Celtic staters and stuff being found on here, so I'm gonna give them a go now. So, we'll see you on the next decent target. And the next one is a button. On to the next one, guys. The next one is in that big clod there. Not a bad signal. Let's see what it is. Yeah, it must have fallen out. Let's get the pinpoint up. Ah, there it is. What's that? A coin or a button?
That's a bloody, is that a 5p? I think it is, isn't it? Oh, you little... Yeah, I think that's a 5p. <laughs> oh well. Right, on to the next. Right, I'm going to give this one a go, guys. Another live live dig. Um, last like, three or four I've had have been shotgun clutches, so hopefully... I don't know, this, this one could be as well, but I don't know, let's see. It's quite stony, this bloody ground. Sounded like it was out. Tell you what, it helps if you actually turn your pinpointer on. in there somewhere. What's that? Bloody hell yeah, no wonder it's making such a bloody big noise. Hit it with a spade, it's like a big, is it a little palm guard maybe? Yeah, a big chunk of lead, whatever it is. Nothing on it. Maybe it's too small to be a palm guard, palm guard though, but I don't know. Just a big piece of lead. All right, on to next. I just had this little one out. Um, I thought it was a Roman, but I'm not sure. It's got a hole through the top of it. I can't see any details on it. No, I can see it anyway. No, I can't see anything on it. No, it could be a little Roman that's been made into like a pendant or something, I don't know. Can't see any details. Sorry, I'm just trying to look through the camera. Get it to focus, there you go. Yeah, I think there is something there, but I don't know what. Right, if I get it cleaned up and get it any better, I'll put it on. If not, then it'll be a mystery. Right, see you on next. Right, got another little little green thing there. Not sure if it's a coin or a button yet. Let's have a little look. Ah, it's a bloody button again. Ah, it's one of those days today, I think. Don't think there's anything on it either. No, just a plain old button. Right, got the next one in there, guys. You can see it. Hopefully this one is a coin this time and not a bloody button. Ooh, what's that? Oh, what is that? That's um that's silver guys. <laughs> wow. Uh, wait a minute. Is that a little hammered? I reckon that's a some sort of hammered, sorry, the camera's not really focusing, there we go. Yep, I reckon that's a hammered. Oh, get in. I've just come on this field, everybody said it's been done to death, because this is where someone found a stator. So everybody's been on here loads of times. But, um, yeah, first signal on here. Looks like a little hammered. It's very worn, whatever it is, but there's nothing on that side. But, yeah, definitely a shield on that side. That, that be Elizabeth, I think. There's a date up the top there, I can't remember now which one it is. But cool, got a little hammy. Nice one, get in. I think that's the biggest hammy I've had actually. I normally get little pennies. I don't think that's a groat, that might be like a half groat. Cool. Oh, I'm well happy with that. Right, see you on the next one. I just got this one guys, and um, I think it might be a little rose farthing, looks like it, that's what it looks like to me, which probably counts as another hammered really, I think they're hammered, they're copper I think, yeah look it's a little rose farthing, you can see it there, lovely, 
I'm going to take that. Two hammers. <laughs> Get in. All right. There you go. There's a little rose in the middle of that. I can't remember what's on that side. It looks like a cross or something. But... Cool. All right. See you on the next one. All right. Just got this one, guys. A little half crown. Um, let's see the date. Where would it be? Um, I don't know, I can't see it now. I don't know where the date would be on this one. Oh, there it is. 1950, is it, I think? Yeah, 1950, half crown. Cool. Lovely. All right, on to the next. Right, guys. That's that. Another one done. Um, it's quite a good dig in the end, actually. I didn't mind it. It's long. This land is always hard because there's always loads of land to go over. And I can never make up my mind which, which field I want to stay on, so I end up walking around for miles. Um, I've done the full eight hours as well, so yeah, not bad though. I mean, the morning I didn't find too much, and the second half of the day I got over to that um, field that they said it was done, but got hammered straight away since I got on there. Got a little rose farb in as well, a little half crown, got a few bits. Uh, that hammered, I was just looking at it just now, I think it's Charles the first shilling, but it's been clipped really badly. I'll just turn it around and let you have a little look. So if you just see how badly clipped it is, it's absolutely just clipped right, well, as much as it can be clipped, I suppose. But I think it's Charles the first. So it's got the little X, X11, X11 there, sorry. So that's the 12, so that's a shilling. I can't make out the head, but it's been completely worn off. But yeah, just look how badly it's clipped though. It's just, I've never seen one's clipped so much as that. But yeah, still hammered still good so so yeah that's it now then um probably next time i'll see you i'll be on my roman field hopefully i'm hoping it'll be plowed i gave my um my roman oh god what was it Ves vespasian silver i gave to the farmer yesterday he was happy it just felt like the right thing to do so i gave it to him um yeah he was happy with that so he's going to show his brother and that and show his family what sort of stuff's being found on the land so yeah that's good Sort of seemed like a good thing to do, just hand it over to the farmer, let him have a bit of history that's on his land. So, yeah, that's gone. A little bit upset, but got to be done, isn't it? So, yeah. Um, yeah, so next time I see you, I should be on the Roman field, hopefully finding more Romans. So, um, yeah, please subscribe, like the video if you liked it, and I'll see you on the next one. Laters.